friends, Stormy Strike here, and in this video, I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the third release for the 2017 Stablemate Club Wolfgang, who is like, I'm super excited about this Stablemate. This is like the first one this year that I'm actually like really excited about. The other two, Coco is really pretty, and then this guy, uh, whose name I don't remember at the moment, uh, they're both really pretty and really glossy and nice and stuff, but I was never really excited about either of them. But this guy, this new release one, I'm really excited about. And so this was the second release. I did a video on him on him already. You can check it out at the uh, card up there or at the end of this video. I'll try to put a link to that too. But I would have Coco out here too, but I don't know where she is at the moment. So yeah, there's that other little guy. But let's actually unbox Wolfgang. So here's his little box. And then once again, all the... Stable mates are coming in these really cool little blue bags, and they say 2017 Stable Mates Club. Get this little guy's bag open, and it has a little sticker on the back of the plastic that says uh, Wolfgang on it. So we know that that is him. The bags do not, they're like actually silk bags and never have their names, except for like the Premier Club models seem to have the little Stable Mates names on them. I don't know. But these ones just say 2017 Steel Mate Club. Come on, you little guy. Come on out of there. Get him out of the bubble wrap. I'm so excited because he looks so cute. Let's see you, little feller. Let's see this little feller. Ah, so many things to open. Here he is. Oh my goodness, he is gorgeous. So here is little Wolfgang. Oh my goodness, I am in love with him already. He is, wow, he is stunning, super stunning. Uh, I love this mold. So he makes like a nice little like Frisian uh, sport horse. Reminds me of actually the um, Star Stable Frisian sport horse, Appaloosa one kind of, in a sense. Uh, I noticed his like hoof here is kind of rough while I'm holding it. Like there's a little bit of gloss that's stuck out on there. So that's kind of a flaw, but you can't really see it. It's just you can feel it when you're holding him. It's like really pokey. Nope, you can't see that. Sorry. It's really pokey. Pokey pokey. Oh my goodness, he is so cute though. Otherwise, I think he looks really nice. I don't really see any other flaws on him at all. He looks really cool. I kind of don't like how they painted his ears. They kind of look a little weird. Just how they're like little black tipped ears. But it's cute. He's really cute. Oh my goodness. Really, really adorable. So, there's a better, let's get a better look at him here. You can see his cute little face. His masking is really well done, it looks like. I like his really, really pretty, pretty, pretty face. I love all these spots. And it's kind of cute too, because some of his spots have masking and some don't, or most don't, but then a couple of them do. So there's a spot on his neck that has masking. And there's a spot on his shoulder that does. And, oh, look at his legs, too. They're really nicely done. The masking and kind of quite a bit of detail on him. I really like these masked off uh, Appaloosa spots better than, like, the really splattery ones they do sometimes on the stable mates or the little round dot ones. I just don't like those ones as much. But this guy is exactly what I like to see as an Appaloosa stable mate. Super pretty. And I like his tail. It's a nice white that fades to a really pretty shade of gray. That looks really nice. And there's his little hooves. These are so cute. They actually are striped a little bit. Oh, there is some bubbling in his gloss on one of his hooves here. But otherwise, he seems really nice. I think the glossing is just the only thing that kind of messed up a little bit on this guy. But even then, he is still a really nice, nice, nice little model. So again, he has a couple, couple spots. Actually, three, four spots right there that have masking. And then there's two spots on his neck that have masking. Really cute. There's the top of him. Oh, he is so pretty. I'm also curious as to why all the um, Stablemate Club models so far have all been glossy. And I uh, would have Coco out here too if I knew where she was. But so far, all three releases have been glossy, which I find interesting. I'm not really sure why that is, and I'm wondering if the next one's going to be glossy or not. So that is interesting. But he is so cute, oh my goodness. 
Look at his little hooves. They're so cute. And his little spots. Very adorable. On his underbelly, yeah, you can't really read it, but it has the Briar Stamp logo in there. And he also has some neat, like, molting spots on him uh, as well. It's pretty cool. His hooves are actually really nicely done. Like, I don't know if it's picking up well on my camera. But his hooves actually are striped, which is really cool. Really nicely little detailed guy. So that is Wolfgang. I also love his name. That's an awesome name. I like that name, Wolfgang. I've always liked that name. So there he is. Super cute little guy. And then I guess that's pretty much all for this video. I just want to do a quick little unboxing and review on him because he is so darn adorable. So that is Wolfgang. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, everybody!